you going to stop right there, okay, see? Because that don't make sense to me. So what you're saying is, if I'm here till 6 o'clock, I'm just not getting paid for that last hour. Because you're telling me the magical time clock that makes sure we get paid stops at 5 now. Uh, yeah, that's exactly what I'm telling you. Okay, that is not a magic time clock or whatever you're trying to call it. It's a time clock that we will no longer be letting add overtime to. All right, so you're here till five. Get your job done before five. If you can't do that, maybe you just need to plan your day out a little bit better. You know, do things a little bit more efficiently. You know, step back and look at it and make sure you're doing things the correct way in a timely manner. Plan my day out better. That, that's not how things work around here, okay? Y'all come up to me at like 3.30 every single evening and give me a random list of things to do that is obviously going to take me at least three to four hours to get done. I mean, you've had the list all day. You could have brought it to me at any time in the morning, but you chose not to. So what you're telling me is all this stuff that you bring me to do, I'm just going to have to like magically figure out how to get it done in the half of the time that it usually takes. To make sure I get paid. Don't be ridiculous, okay? The list of things that we need done that we bring to you in the evening is to be done that evening. All right, we don't give you the list in the morning because you'll take all day to do it. We give you things that we know you can accomplish in the time that you have left in the day. All right, so I suggest you just figure it out because you're not getting paid overtime. All right, on to next business. Okay. We'll see how this plays out, but I can guarantee it ain't gonna go the way you want it to. Hey, Ricky, real quick, man. Hey, I know it's getting later in the evening, but I wanted to let you know that somebody ran over the main water valve out there at the road. I was wondering if you could just run out there real quick and get that fixed. Okay, we got a lot of stuff going on. We need the bathrooms back working and everything like that. So just let me know when you get it done, all right? Fix the water valve? Listen here, homeboy, you said you know it's later in the evening, but do you realize what time it really is? Okay? We are minutes away from me starting my clock out process, okay? I can, I'm pretty much already gone at this point, and you want me to go out there and dig up that valve? Do what? Yes, I do know what time it is, okay? You have plenty of time to fix it, all right? Just get out there, start working on it, and figure it out, okay? It's not that hard. Get it done. Okay, you know, it was support like that. Why, why, how could I say no? <laughs> See you later. I got just enough time left in the day to teach him a lesson. Let's go ahead and get it done. See, Ricky, I knew you could do it. You pretty much got everything replaced already. Everything's looking good. I told you you could do it. Yeah, I about got it done. All I got to do is tighten up that joint right there, and I'm done. And then probably take one, two minutes. Maybe. Ooh. I'll get it tomorrow. <laughs> hey, well, well, what, what do you mean we'll get it tomorrow? Hey, there's nobody with any plumbing experience on night shift, okay? You, you gotta wrap this up, okay? What what are you doing? Oh, you, you don't have anybody on night shift with plumbing experience? Well, I guess you can tell them to YouTube it or something, okay? Because uh, if I'm not wrong, I don't get paid overtime, and I was off the clock 36 seconds ago, and I've already planned to do something across town in 15 minutes from now, so I might have to hit you later, but hey, let me know when overtime comes back. I'll be sure to handle shit like this for you.